The Polaris Fleet Ballistic Missile Submarine, Ethan Allen, assigned as the launching ship, was being raided for sea at Charleston, South Carolina. She was fully combat loaded with 16 service Polaris missiles. Four of these had been modified as a peacetime safety feature of the test by the addition of a tracking beacon and a destruct system. However, these changes in no way modified the combat capability of the missiles or of the submarine. The 1962 test of the nuclear aircraft by Joint Task Force 8 provided an underwater effects test of the nuclear aircraft and submarine weapons.